everybody, welcome to my YouTube, I'm Jen. Today we are going to unbox and take a look at the new Cricut Bright 360. Let's talk stats. The Cricut Bright 360 measures brightness by lux, the floor model measures 3000 lux, and the table lamp measures 1500 lux. The lighting temperature is fully adjustable from 2900K to a cool, from a warm 2900K to a cool 5200K. Um, or anything in between, you have a little bar that can actually adjust um, more or less. And there's actually two of them. There's one for the temperature um, and one for the brightness as well. The LEDs are super long lasting um, and bright. Um, it's very even, like I have a studio lamp that you can see every single bulb that's in there. Um, this one you can't see it, it's a really even um, light distribution. Um, the diffusing is very nice. It has a bright and even light that does help eliminate shadows and hot spots. And finally, measuring the CRI index of the light, it comes out to a 95. CRI is the color rendering index, which measures how the colors look under a light source when compared to sunlight. Um, the index is measured between 0 and 100 with the perfect 100, indicating that colors under the light source seem the same as they would under natural light. Um, with the CRI of 95, most lamps actually have 80 or less. So if you're doing photography, painting, mixed media artwork, anything like that, you're definitely going to see more color accuracy um, and less eye strain as well, which might not be because of CRI, but I've definitely noticed a lot less eye strain. This thing is pretty heavy, weighing in at 14.8 pounds for the floor model. I believe the table model weighs 8.7 pounds. The height can adjust from anywhere from 46 inches to 56 inches. It does have a 360 placement, so you can turn it around if you need to. However, there is a cord attached to the bar and not the base. So keep in mind that while you're spinning it, um, you may need to readjust the cord every once in a while. That was one thing that I did note with Cricut that they should put the cord in the base so that you can turn it around as much as you want. You can just grab the head and adjust as needed up and down, um, face it forward, face it back, um, totally adjustable, and um, yeah, you don't have to worry about grabbing it anywhere specific, just grab the head of the light. The back does have a counterweight, um, but that's just there for weight. Open up this bad boy and take a peek inside. Here you see that they have a lot of padding in here, very secure while they're shipping. This box is very sturdy. Um, it looks like it comes in three pieces, so it uh, is very easy to put together. Um, all of the information is here along with a warranty card. There is a one-year warranty um, on this lamp, so if you have any problems, definitely reach out to Cricut and they will help you out. Assembly is pretty easy. There is this piece in the middle that one end has the power. The other end has an arrow facing that arrow is where you're going to put the light mechanism and the cord goes to the bottom. Something to note, once this put, is put together, it is permanent. It's not coming back apart. So to put it together, you put this end in and you push down until you hear a click. There you go. This is also where the plug will go. So you just plug it in right there. Easy peasy. Now for the hard part. Take the light mechanism. You line the arrows up and you push it down done now your lamp is assembled there you have it the cricut bright 360 floor lamp in all its glory let's talk about the elephant in the room while we're here the price this sucker does come in at 249.99 and discounts do not work at this point um, the Cricut Access 10% discount does at the time of recording, however, my group discount does not, so I apologize for that. Um, the table lamp does also come in at $199.99. Well, this has been the topic of a lot of heated discussions on Facebook. I did want to point that out, that it does have a steep price point, but from what I'm seeing, it's definitely been worth it in my studio space, and I know everybody's studio space is different. Um, I was highly lacking the 
studio lighting that I needed. Um, and although I do have some pretty expensive studio lights, this has come to be an amazing contender for those lights. Let's look at those pictures real quick. This photo was taken with my old studio lighting. I definitely love the colors, love how this turned out. However, this one was taken with the Cricut Bright 360. It has definitely brought another layer to my photos and seems to make the whites pop even more. Um, as far as eye strain, I do feel like my eye strain is a lot less. I don't know if that's the looms or the CRI or what it is, but I do know that my eyes feel better and Let's face it, old age um, kind of does, does a number on your eyes. So happy to have it. Thank you, Cricut, for sending this to me to review. Overall, I do think it's worth it. Thanks for watching, everybody, and have an amazing day.